Hey y'all, your girl is back with another vlog. So welcome to my channel. If you are new here, my name is Shakayla. If you're returning, thank you so much for being here. I really do appreciate it. Y'all, it's been a couple weeks since I did a little midday, I mean midweek vlog. But that's because your girl has had a lot going on. I previously told y'all I was a matron of honor in a wedding. So we had the wedding this past weekend. I'm about to insert a clip here. Y'all know how I do. How are you feeling? I feel good. You ready to go see your man? Yeah, your I man. am. My man. Your man. I'm ready. Thank you. We are. So the wedding literally so much fun. Like we had such a good time and hence the hair change. So for the wedding, we were all supposed to wear a middle part so or just like a middle part ponytail. Y'all, the way my middle part is set up, my middle part, like it's so damaged. So I ended up having to go with a side part, but I'm also very, very shocked because I am fully natural and like how my hair is doing like it's actually doing really good i'm definitely about to get some braids um but today i took sir sir come here i took sir sir had a grooming appointment come here baby y'all see my baby he don't feel good you want to say hi say hi <laughs> are you gonna lay down where are you going you gonna get down oh oh yeah i thought he threw up he just burped oh my gosh i was about to be so <laughs> be so upset you okay buddy but yes yeah, so i took him to get groomed today i also added some recipes to my website i recorded a like a video of me making the walnut meat and then i need to go clean up the kitchen because that kitchen is a mess i don't want brandon coming home and be like girl a tornado flew around my room before you came excuse the mess it made it usually does that would be me that would be me. Y'all, I went to, I feel like I'm talking so much because I haven't talked to y'all in so long. Oh my gosh. But I went to tennis the other day. <laughs> I went to tennis the other day and I put like this headband on, right? I feel like you can't really tell. I'm going to put up a picture because it was bad the first day. It was bad, but I put this headband on and I, I swear I left my thinking cap at home. Like I did not have my thinking cap on, child. I was like, oh my gosh it was so bad but i feel like you can't even tell right now honestly but anyway i need to figure something out to do because your girl is getting deep into tennis and i want to keep it up but i also want to maintain my hair and that's really why those protective styles were so good oh my gosh i feel like I, like i said i feel like i haven't talked to you in so long so that's why i'm just like word vomit <laughs> Oh, and then I went and got my, listen, so many updates, so many updates. I went to the dentist yesterday and I only have two more trays left. I thought I had like nine months. I only have two more trays left. But I'm feeling really good about it. I feel like I'm going to wait until like the very end to see how satisfied I am. Because if I'm not satisfied, we're going to go longer. But I'm feeling good. But anyway, I'm about to go clean up the kitchen, so let's go do that.
my boo just got home from work so i'm about to hang out with him a little bit but i need to figure out what so tomorrow is a day where i record reels babe what's another recipe i can make tomorrow i have tofu you got i have some lentils i have sweet potato breakfast, like a breakfast maybe a hash or omelet i would have to soak some for the omelet i would have to soak mung beans or scramble <laughs> or hash yeah, I'm trying to think, like, what could I put in there, though? And then also, like, what would pe what would make people be like, ooh, I need to make this? When was that time you made waffles? It's been a minute. So maybe some waffles, matcha waffles. Ooh, that would be cool. That would be. Should I do a smoothie? <laughs> <laughs> We don't have any plant milk, and I don't feel like making any tomorrow. Um, like, can you go wrong? Can't go wrong with a smoothie, like a like a tasty green smoothie. Ooh, like a protein, tasty protein green smoothie. Sounds like you know what you want to do. No, what else help? Um, Maybe like. You know how we made those egg cups? I'm moving y'all back. You know how we made those egg cups for me? Uh-huh. Like, kind of like the egg cups that are at Starbucks? Yeah, but the only thing is I don't, I'm not using just egg anymore. <laughs> Everything I like has egg in it. Um... Should I do like... You know what? Could what? be... Maybe you could do like... Um, as a snack, like... Some Uncrustables or something from scratch? Hmm. I could. <laughs> <laughs> no, stop! I could! I just don't eat those. I mean, like... You were... I don't know how... The, is, is it that... Like, is I, feel it? Like, I feel like you felt bad for giving me so many <laughs> no's that you were like, oh, yeah... <laughs> So then I would just have to use bread and like peanut butter and jelly. How about you try like a dessert or something? I know. Like a coffee cake. Yeah. No? <laughs> you okay. gotta think about who, who I am. I don't bake. You baked before. Oh, what about... Oh, I don't have any fresh bananas and I'm not going... So that's another thing, y'all. I'm not going to the grocery store. So I have to make it work with what I have in the house. How about, ooh, a green smoothie with protein? I love that idea! I know. That is an amazing idea. Mm. I'm probably young. Sounds like you have it all figured out. <laughs> <laughs> all right, I'll see y'all in a little bit. Hey y'all, okay, so clearly in the car because Brandon, <laughs> he was going to, uh oh. Okay, I'm back. He was going to ten. I mean, he was going to golf, and I was like, "Oh my gosh, let me come up here and go to tennis." So I found out that our um, like the court that I play on, I can did they accept it? Oh, that's not it. That they have like a ball machine, so I will be able to, I guess, put I have some balls, put my balls in the ball machine, and hopefully I can play that way. If not, I'm just gonna be hitting it across the court. I really wish I had that ball machine or that I had somebody to play with. Cause I, the only thing I can do is serve. Ready for Brandon to get over here. It's like people out here playing with folks. They like legit got games going on and you can tell they're actually good. So, ciao. Normally I'd be like, can I join you? or I would if I was really good at what I was doing, but one day I'll get there. One day, one day, one day. Good morning. I could start running down the stairs. But yeah, so it is Thursday. I got some deliveries. This is like 
stuff that we ordered. Brandon messed up my baking sheet. So I was like, well, you messed it up. So you gotta give me a new one. Look at how pretty this green is. So I just got two new baking sheets because Brandon messed one up. What a great deal. I am about to make a matcha. I'm gonna bring y'all over here. Cause y'all know I love me some matcha chow. I don't even have any milk. So I can't make matcha. Some walnuts that have been. So I added this to my video. Let me know what you thought of it. I created it using Canva. So I have it, I, you know, took the graphics and all that from their little um, thingy right there, but I created that. And I really, really like the look of it. I also thought it was a really cool touch. So let me know what you think about it. Oh, and I'm just having a protein. Can you focus on, there we go. And then I've been trying to make matcha, so matcha lattes using protein, like a protein shake drink. <gasps> That's what I can do right now. Oh my gosh, genius. And I can actually use the matcha that I got. Beautiful. I know I've made matcha like 10,000 times on my channel before, so I will not bore y'all. I'm about to make my tacos. I got my mushroom and walnut meat. Something I'm thinking about doing is adding, so I bought some pea protein. Let me show you. So I bought some neutral or unflavored pea protein. It says like one tablespoon of this protein powder has eight grams of protein. Eight grams of protein. What? So I'm thinking about going forward, I'm going to mix some of this with this to add some extra protein to the mushroom and walnut meat. Genius, I know, I know. I'm leaving, I'm leaving. Thank you. Think I'm just about over being your girlfriend. I'm leaving, I'm leaving. <laughs> oh my gosh. I'm so entertaining. Wow. Wow. Eating my tacos. We are back home. I'm about to shower. Wind down, get ready for bed. But I will see y'all in the morning. So right now, I'm actually about to record a reel and a video for TikTok. I wanna do those lettuce wraps. It's in the video still. I was gonna like get dress dress, but y'all gonna get what y'all gonna get, okay? You all packed up already? Yeah, just about. I'm gonna miss you. You need to be coming with me. Good to be able to hang out with sir. Right, <laughs> <laughs> so good. I'm about to clean up because I made a mess. So, yo, yo, yo. What's happening? What's happening? Lean with I was recording content. Like that, I was like, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> You're like, uh, not quite. Nah, 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 nah. Yeah, yeah. I'm on last night. I'm fine. So 
So I'm scarf shoddy <laughs> until the morning. I do not want my edges or anything to be messed up because I don't want to put much heat on it tomorrow. As you can tell, your girl is tired, tired, tired. I also do want to mention that I'm going to officially change my name on YouTube from Sweet Green Speaking. I think I'm just going to go with my actual name, um, mainly because two things. One, somebody else brought up this point as well, but I've also been thinking about it. Like, as I continue to pray for God to expand my territory, I think I will come up against a lot of like, I don't know what the word is, um, roadblocks because there is a restaurant called Sweet Green. If I were to keep Sweet Greens vegan and continue to grow, like I could see myself getting like a legal battle with that company and I do not want that or need that. And then two, like over the years, I've become more knowledgeable of what it means to be vegan and also just the different terms that are out there. And I associate more with plant-based. Like what I do and what my mission is is more associated with plant-based versus veganism. That's also another thing. I don't want to confuse a bunch of people. But I'm here for food. And I can't take vegan and just focus on food. You know? Because it is more than food. And if you do take vegan and focus solely on food, that's actually plant-based. So I consider myself to be plant-based my diet is a plant-based vegan diet it's not necessarily like I wouldn't consider myself to be a vegan because it does take things a step further I hope that makes sense um but yes I'll be changing my name please stick around please please stick around but yeah so I keep yawning oh my god back at the hotel i feel like this is like one of those um vogue like my beauty routine videos oh my gosh that's so funny So I wanted to just quickly talk about this. So while I was at um, that restaurant, so I guess, let me back up. I actually used to live in Philadelphia. I lived in Philly like a handful of years ago. And that's actually where I started my plant-based journey in Philly. So it's very like nostalgic being here. I went to one of the restaurants that I used to go to all the time in Philly. Yo, I got the nachos, but they used impossible meat inside of it. When I tell y'all, I was like, I can't do this no more. I don't know why, but when I went to take a bite, like I just had the mushroom and walnut meat at the top of my mind. Y'all, I don't think I am a fan of impossible meat anymore, which is very shocking to me. I've high key, high, high, high key been praying that God changes my taste buds. And I know he's still working on me. But I've been praying, like, God, please change my taste buds. Like, you know, let me crave food that is nutritious for my body. And I think he said, all right, you prayed it, so get ready. I was just watching this vlog. She's talking about, like, how 
this looks so silly how transparent she wants to be with her audience which i can like truly truly respect something that i've been trying to get better at is you know whenever i feel away or something is frustrating me or i'm like in my head i think it's so easy to just like vent about it and sometimes venting is healthy so like get it out of your system but as i dig deeper into my relationship with jesus i am learning to take my problems and things like that to him versus allowing myself to get like super frustrated super down and i mean i, I know that on this walk like you're still gonna run into you know days where your flesh wants to overpower your spirit. I kind of struggle with the vulnerability aspect because I don't want to feed it. I don't want to put more energy towards it by speaking to it and putting it on the internet. Like I want to have a community where people feel like she's human. She feels the same feelings that I feel like this is absolutely normal. Like I deal with stuff just like everybody else. I'm just trying to work on not feeding on yeah on not feeding those things but yeah i just wanted to get back on here and talk about that like working to ensure that you know people know that i'm human i deal with things as well and like i know like whenever i get on here like i'm always like smiling and happy and like granted i am happy in life like i am but i also deal with things as well so Anyway, please let me know your thoughts in the comments. Like, I would love to hear your take on that as well. But I'll see y'all when I finish getting ready. Well, y'all can't really see me, but, oh, maybe I can now. But yeah, so I just have this gold dress on with these little heels. Love, love, love. I feel so pretty and I love my dress. Here it is in better lighting. Really love it. Touch up the lip. Let's go party. It's so cute. I'm so excited. All right, y'all, so finally made it back home. Brandon and Sir came to pick me up. Say hi, buddy. They came to pick me up. We just pulled up to Trader Joe's because I really want to have a pizza night. Brandon is down. And so we're just gonna do pizza, our little Sunday reset. But I just wanted to make sure I end the vlog and say thank you so much for watching. I really hope that you enjoyed it. Boy, I'm trying to talk. Don't do it don't you do it but see y'all in the next video bye